Welcome to the Everyday Mom Challenge. This is episode 124. When things fall apart, they come together. Okay, let's turn to our Bibles. We're going to look at Psalm 27, 1. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? You know, it seems like when one thing goes wrong, it just doesn't stop there. It's almost as if we can get ourselves in an avalanche of disaster. And we just keep spiraling and spiraling out of control. I think about how it is to upkeep an older home. And you could think you're doing all the right things. And then the one day you happen to forget to cut on the water to let it drip, drip, drip through the faucets. It freezes and pipes burst. A wind comes. Slate shifts. The roof leaks. Kids run through the house, wrestling, pushing on cabinet sinks. Faucet breaks. Someone tries to break in. Glass shatters. Locks broken. And it's like, you can pout about it all. And that's our natural reaction to want to do. Or we can say there's a purpose. Because God is my stronghold. God is my shelter. God is my provider. And I can overcome with the purpose. I can stay defeated with the pout. As I was driving up today, I had the opportunity to see the most glorious sunrise. I looked to the right and I saw it breaking through the trees and it was just this beautiful orange orb. Not a cloud in the sky. And I said, God gives us a new day to fix what we couldn't fix yesterday. And things might not all come together at one time. It may not be on the timeline that we've set for ourselves. But if we put our trust and our faith in Him, let us not be afraid of what the day brings. Let us not fear the night. For God is our light and our salvation. He is our stronghold. I would ask for all of you to pray for me and I'll pray for you. We need to build each other up. And that is our purpose, to build each other up in Christ and to share this verse with somebody that may be struggling or having a hard time. So I challenge you to go find Psalm 27.1. You can copy it and paste it and put it in text messages, send it on Instant Messenger on Facebook, put it on your wall, put it on your newsfeed. Find an image. Write it in a letter. Put it on a sticky note on your fridge. And let us comfort somebody today who says, 
everything's falling apart and let them know that with God's purpose it will all come together that this too shall pass so pray for me and I'm praying for you and I'll see you tomorrow